Hey, what's up? Roman Dark. I have a special guitar. This is Stella. This guitar is probably 40 years old. It came from Soviet era around the 80s, Southern Russia, Rostov on Don. Engineers wanted to make something special to compete with other guitar builders in the world. So they built Stella guitar. This passive guitar has 5 knobs and 8 switches. Because this is a stereo guitar. It has 4 pickups and 2 of them split in half. So upper 3 strings goes to one channel and lower strings goes to another channel. Also, you can combine RC filters to create different tones and stereo effects. I'll try to fix it and check the sound. The fret so flat that I even thought that was normal for the guitar. But I don't think there is enough material left to round it. It has the zero fret. Intonation is not good. The note on the 12th fret is higher than open string note. The knobs are loose. He is supposed to be a cool plate. I don't think I can replicate it. Let's open and see what's inside. Wow, potentiometers from my childhood and funny 5-pin jack. I did a quick test. Potentiometers are dead, but pickups working. I bought new potentiometers, almost the same parameters. And I bought these knobs. I think they fit well and no English labels on them. It's a Soviet guitar after all. It can't have capitalistic volume and tone labels. I needed a new metal plate for the potentiometers. And my ruler was just what I needed. I definitely need a stereo socket. But if you use mono jack, you put one of the channel to the ground. I will alternate the schematic to prevent that. The knobs definitely need to be changed.
I investigated the schematic and here is the meaning of knobs and switches. Now I can solder the new plate. Ground first. I decided to leave the original ancient capacitors. For signal I use a shielded wire. I reused the original plate for the output jack. I shielded the cavity with the aluminum foil. New strings and it's ready for the sound check. <laughs> 